Hi everybody, it's SK again. In the last episode, the inaugural episode as a matter of fact, uh, I basically retreaded all of the stuff that I had done before and defeated a devil weird gizmo. It's called a gizmo? It's literally called a gizmo? Alright, uh, but apparently like the king got possessed and you know, I, I lost one of my team members because I'm an idiot. And, and then I went to save and all that good stuff, so now we're back. Hi. We're continuing, we're counting on you, good luck. And can I talk to Kingman? Thank you. Depart to fetch Howell immediately. How do I do that? How do I go about departing the fetchy stuffs? Astro, you alive, my man? Are you going to see Mr. Howell? I wouldn't let you go alone if I weren't. I trust you, son. So are they actually like related sort of thing? Thank you, Bowie. You've saved the king's life. I thought you were going to yield. I'll take care of Sir Astral for you. Please be careful. I'm a little bit sad that, you know, she might not be coming along with me. That's kind of like Final Fantasy- or, excuse me, Shining Force Trope right about there. Yep, still flustered. Okay. That wasn't like a ritual. I wasn't trying to like, you know, get a whiff before I left or something to that effect. I was just trying to see if something had changed. You know, scientific research and all that. Alright, so I gotta go yield. I get the feeling that the moment I leave town, I'm going to get attacked, yeah? Is that kind of how this usually works? You guys still asleep? Yep. What about you? Can't sleep. He keeps snoring. Ooh, sucks to be you, pal. That's what earplugs are for. Best town music, man. I think I've actually started to memorize this already. The song's fun. I also tried to change it so that way there wasn't like a half second delay between me singing and the game like registering it sort of dealio so that's my bad so hopefully it'll be correct this time so yes i want to buy stuff for you from you i have 400 where the hell did i get 400 gold from no 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 i don't want i don't want nothing from you good sir i want the guy who has weapons This song is so happy, I love it! He already has a short sword, short spear. Actually... Actually, I'm gonna buy you, like, a short sword. Because you have a fucking wooden sword, and that's just garbage tier. Oh, you all have, like, shit tier stuff. Okay, because you're kids. Of course it is. Alright. Well, she already has a wooden rod, so I guess... Oh, well, that's an odd thing to say. Yes. Actually, get... Yes. I don't want to buy anything, but I would like to... Uh, there's actually nothing that needs repairing, but I would like to sell my wooden sword, please. Pay 45 gold, because someone's actually going to pay 45 gold for a piece of wood. Okay. I'm literally not going to say anything, but seriously, go oh, crazy pants. So let's save one more time. So that way I don't forget later. I mean, this is all just stupid maintenance -y shit, but, you know. I probably should have done it before going off screen, or before recording, but, you know, thinking is hard. Also, this dude totally looks like Friar Tuck. I miss the old guy that kind of looked like Odo. Not Odo, Quark. There we go. Yes, I will continue my adventure. So, I'm assuming I'm going out to where the guard before was just like, Nope, you're not leaving, and now I'm gonna leave, so... F you, guard. Here you are! I've been waiting! What? The soldier said you went to the castle. Is that true? Oh, I missed it! I would've woken up early if I knew that. So I came to meet you here. You're going to heal, right? Under the king's orders. Cool, of course I'm going to. Of course she's going. Jaha, the war. The war. Of course, the war. Let's go! I 
want, no, I don't want magic, I want item. Well, he, at least he has a regular, an actual weapon. So I don't have to worry about that, Chaz. Alright, let's see what we got. Yep, here we go. So what do we got? Okay, I got an ooze. I got oozes and rats and stuff, right? Oh, this, like, open world music is sweet as shit. It's very adventurous sounding. First thing I'm going to do is attack, well, find my way up here because I can. Mainly because I'm in kind of like a bit of a slaughter mode after losing Chester Cheeto, my friend. He needs to get that EXP back up, you know what I mean? That's fine. Probably can take a hit. Ho! That, that, that was okay. Alright. Alright, Jaha! Hot diggity damn Jaha! I like you, good sir. I like you. You're pretty. You're pretty. Alright, Chester. Oh yeah, that's right, you have a spear. Sweet. I forgot about that little tidbit. That's right, spears. I know spears. It's a smelly smell that smells smelly. And I'm actually gonna go ahead and heal him. Even though he's he's only 7 HP down, that guy man is supposed to take off half of his health in one shot. So I would really rather not have to uh, find out the hard way that, uh, that they can do exactly that and more. Aw, oh, you're not gonna eat the priest, are you? That's not cool. Gotch. Oh, alright, that's cool. Just, just ignore the mouse guy that almost wrecked your face. That's cool, you know. More power to you, I'm supposed I'm, I'm sure. Alright, these oozes actually hit fairly hard. Maybe I should have paid attention to the whole, like, they might need armor thing. Murder late, the ooze, please, thank you. Do they still do the same, like, EXP conventions? I mean, I'm guessing I'm gonna find out pretty soon. The moment I get a turn back, I can actually check to see what the EXP rate is. EXP 83. Yeah, so it's gotta be that, right? Murder the ooze, man. Thank you. Yep, level 2. Alright, okay, so it is every 100 experience you get. Which, again, I, for as far as um, experience paradigms go, I actually kind of like the whole, at a certain... The experience is the same for every single level, but... Ooh! It's, it's the same for every level, however... Uh, words. It's, it's the same for every level, but the experience will diminish depending upon how, you know, strong you are comparative to everything else. So you're gonna hide, and you're gonna heal yourself. There we go. I also like the fact that that gives a decent amount of experience, whereas before it was just a straight 10 experience every time, so your healers became vastly out-leveled. Unless they actually joined in on the, uh, fray. Also, Jaha may fucking die. This is unfortunate. But hey, cool, he got an extra health. Nito, don't kill me, don't kill me. Alright, that's cool. Attack, yeah, attack Bowie. That's- oh, Jesus. Yeah, this just hit fucking hard, man. Oh, fucker it all. Yeah, he ain't gonna survive a hit, so I need to heal Bowie because he will absolutely die. So will Jaha, but hopefully I can get the, uh, the Ooze Man dead if I can get Chester Cheeto down here quick enough. Yes, I can. Yay! I love it when a plan comes together. Don't look at me like that. I totally knew that was gonna happen. I like the fact that it actually shows things that are not on the same, like, tile as you, too. That's, that's kind of cute. Do I want to? No, I do not. I'm gonna hide you back here. And you're gonna tag for me, okay, buddy? Hope you don't mind. Unless he does a super crit, you should be pretty much good to go. I have no MP left. Right. Medical have good. Here. Feed him some weed, alright? That'll make him better. I like the fact that she gets experience for that, too. That's, that's, that's a nice little plus for me. Come on, Chester. 
So have we replaced like the, the, the room knights for giant rats in this one? Is that that's kinda how we're looking at right now? Two, two, two. Okay. It doesn't really matter. They're all level two, so that's fine. Critical hit! Hell yeah! For the exact same amount of damage I did before the critical hit. Woo! Come here, boys. We got some fights to go through. I also get the feeling that Chester may die again by doing this. Because that rat's just gonna be like, nom nom food! Nommy nommy! I have Centaur in my Tommy, and it's tasting pretty goddamn good. Please don't one-shot him. Please don't one-shot him. Okay, good. He didn't get one-shot. Thank you. Well, please take two damage. Oh, you just beautiful creature. You majestic seahorse. Seahorse? I... Okay. I don't have a fucking poop. Ah! So we need to rush to his aid, like quick, fast, and in a hurry. Medical herb, please and thank you. One thing I do say, I kind of like the fact that, you know, me having medicinal herbs is actually super useful, right? At least in the early game. I don't want to, like, kill steal that. He's already level 3. That could go to probably Sarah at this point. And that means that the rat's pretty much guaranteed dead. You really don't like him, do you? That's not cool. Actually, I'm gonna kill the rat. I'm gonna have Sarah kill the ooze, provided she hits him. Because she's gonna need that extra experience. Don't let that be the murder. Okay. Alright. Alright, lady. You do your damage, huh? There you go. Four damage. That's not bad. There we go. How about that shit? I think that went pretty well. Hello! Welcome to Yield. Hi! I'm in Yield. What is Yield? I have no idea. I found a healing seed. Hell yeah! What does a healing seed do? Uh, da -da 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 Let's go give this healing seed to someone else. So I can bring things up. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. I have no idea what I just said, actually. This village is peaceful but boring. I'm tired of living in such a rustic small village. Well, you could always just get attacked by, like, deadly creatures as a cockadoodle do, indeed. That's my head. Don't torment her. I'm not tormenting her, lady. Child, I'm just saying hi to all of the civilians. Are you from Gollum too? No? Maybe Gollum still just asked me where Howl lives. Howl, Howl, Howl. Why is he so poor? He's just an old man. Was that a Marsha, Marsha, Marsha reference? There are no soldiers, no rules, and no noise here. I don't understand those who want to leave this town. Young people nowadays don't know the value of peace. War is not fun, but they think it is. <laughs> Cute commentary. Yes, I know him. He's famous, and he's kind of a screwball. He lives northwest of this village. You can't miss it. Can I play with the piano? An old piano. Thank you. I, I genuinely didn't realize that. By the way, that is sarcasm. I completely realized it. Hello. Oh, you came from Grand Seal? My son is working in Grand Seal. Do you know him? I, I don't know. Do I know him? Civilizations. Ecology. Okay. What about you? I once traveled to Gallum and saw Mr. Lemon there. Oh, he's somebody I'm gonna... Mr. Lemon is the leader of the Gollum Arty, but he is a very kind man. I'm a big fan of Mr. Lemon. He's so cute. So, yeah, he's definitely gonna be a team member. Soldiers are cute. They need armor. Oh, sweet summer child. Candy? Now. The desire will be fulfilled. Yes, record my efforts, please. For all the world to see later on that I am the baller, I think I am. Who is that dude that obviously looks like someone I'm going to be recruiting in that left corner there? Yes, I absolutely will be re recording my journey. I've only been recording for 14 minutes. What can I do for you? Oh, you would like to see my master. I'm studying at his house. Please follow me. Oh, it is hard to follow Kazen. The Howl lives just outside this village. So Howl's probably, like, fucking dead, right? 
He saw those companies. Shh, keep this a secret. I like the boy who was always with him. Uh-huh. Hang on a sec. Nope, nothing down here. Okay, I guess I'm going back up this way. Ah, Shiza. Manelli. What do we got? Ooze, ooze, rat. Rat, ooze. Okay. So I wonder what the difference between normal and all the other difficulties are. Do they just spawn more shit? Have, like, more health? I'm kind of curious now. Again, this is absolutely not the time for me to be like, Wow, man, this game is too easy because I got my ass kicked in the tutorial. Twice. I'm just used to seeing a lot, that, like, the battles being... Oh, hey, it's a huge bat. I'm just used to the battles being much more long and drawn out. Those are usually like 20 minutes in and of themselves. Oh, rat man, you need to like back up off my Cheetos, okay? So how about this, good sir? The oozes are like not even a concern. I can kill them in one or two hits. Oh, thank you, Chester. You're more of a ninja than probably the ninjas I'm likely to get. Alright, let's see. We're gonna have to focus down the rat, obviously. Because the rat is the one that's probably gonna kick my ass. He's the one that is the, uh, and I'm assuming the bat is going to be the big danger as well. Sucks. I hate the bats. They probably have the, the highest evasion rate of all time. I fucking hate bats in this game. Murder the rat, please. You get some decent levels, though. I will say this. The beginning of this music, I get the feeling it's going to start grating on me after a while. Agility 8, mother... Oh. Alright, well, I'm just gonna ignore the bat and pretend it's not there until it's necessary that I backtrack and kill it. That's that's pretty much where I'm at at this juncture in my life. Because I hate the bats in this game, man! They suck! Just earned 31 experience points. Phantasmical. I don't know why I'm talking like this. Because it's fun. But probably infuriating, too. Ha ha ha! Come on, Batman. Throw your ass up, please. Fine. I'll just make Sarah the guinea pig. I'm gonna send Jaha up here. I'm sure he can handle himself for a little while. He's got a healing seed. I'm assuming that's a... I'll send him up here, too. I'm sure Chester can keep her safe, right? Hopefully I didn't just make a huge so god mistake. Okay. Mistakes may have been made. May have been made. Possibly. Hey, cool! Attack, defense, agility, Saraloon, no spell, detox. The no spell, the new spell. Touched you in the no spell. Um, yeah. So, we're gonna run you away so that way the bat can do their thing. Now, if you want to attack Chester, you know, by all means, go for it. I'm totally okay with that. I will say that they have definitely, again, as I mentioned in the last episode, they definitely did do some, uh, like, refining of the systems that they've had versus Shining Force 1. You can tell it's a bit more optimized, like, the, uh, the menus are faster, the animations are faster. Um, everything just feels more fluid. Which is to be expected. I mean, if it's, like, a direct sequel, then it should be... They should be improving certain UI functionality like that, so that way it feels smoother and better. You know what I mean? So, Chester! Oh, man! You, you may be getting left out of the final battle here, but it's okay. You got four legs. Everyone else has two. I'm sure you'll, you'll survive. There we go. See, I told you. Okay, you're gonna be the guinea pig for the bat. Not bat, the rat. Whatever. Bats are just rats with wings anyway. Damn, Bo is becoming a tank real quick. Look at this. I mean, he's level 5. He already has 20 HP. So in 5 levels, he's doubled his HP pool. That's pretty baller. 
but now he's also super out leveling everybody, so I may have to, like, fix that. Maybe. Attack the rat, I probably have either. I actually may have Jaha kill him. She's at level 4. He's at level 4. So let's go ahead and pop the heal off. I'm gonna pop off a heal for Bowie, even though he has more, H yeah, more HP than everyone. You know, he's the main character, it also might give me more experience. No? Okay, apparently not. Alright. I also kind of figured that these guys are gonna, like, dogpile onto Bowie here since they know he exists. Yep. Yeah, he would have been in a real bad way if I hadn't healed him. Okay, that's a fine. That's a fine. That's so good. I'm a horrible person, but that's fine. That's a fine. I'm actually going to give the last kill to Jaha as well. Well. Yeah, I'm going to give. I'm going to have Sarah take a crack at him. Hopefully, she won't kill him. Good, okay. He gets good experience, well, experience, maybe not good experience, but experience for it. That way Jaha can get the last kill here and maybe he can catch up to everybody else. Not quite at level 4, but he should be level 4 fairly soon. So why the hell, what the hell, Kazen, whatever the hell your name is? You were like all up following me and then this shit happens and you're just kind of doing nothing, my friend? Sucks to be you, my friend. This is Howell's house. Mr. Howell, Grand Seal friends are here. He's dead, isn't he? Strange. There's no answer. Has he gone somewhere? Why well, don't you wait for him inside? Yep. Who are you? Oh, Sir Howell. Oops. You came back early. You. What did you do to Sir Howell? What are you running to, bitch? Did he just trip? Oh, Kazen. Sir, you're alive. There's no use running after them. Where is his head? Oh, I was looking at him upside down. I thought, like, the big orange-white thing on the right-hand side was, like, his head, and that blue jewel was just, like, some sort of head dormant thing. And I thought the rest of his body was some sort of weird, like... I don't know, man. It just it looked real fucking weird. But now that I realize that his head's on the left side, it makes life a lot easier. Are you okay, sir? Why do they do such a cruel thing? Or why? They're Gollum soldiers. They demanded my notes on ground seal. They suddenly snatched at them and... cough. Whisper. <gasps> the protagonist spoke, guys! Who is it? What did he say? It's Bowie from Grand Seal. He said that the ground seal has opened. And a serious disaster took place. He came to see you for more information. What? The door opened. They broke the ancient seal. Calm down, sir. Why are you so excited? If this dude is researching this shit, obviously it's important. Cough, cough. Kazen, listen to me carefully. Grand's Isle is lost. That tower is a sacred seal that confines a terrible devil. Two jewels. Cough. We're installed to... Eh, eh. Stop talking or you'll die. I'm almost dead anyway. Cough, cough. Kazen, look for the jewels to seal ancient... And dead. Don't leave me alone! Oh no! Sir Howell passed away. I'm going to seal the tower. It's Sir Howell's last wish. Bowie, please, it's his wish related to your mission, right? Can you go with me and seal the tower? Aww. Okay, that is like the saddest joy music ever. Now, let's go to the ancient shrine. No problem, after I investigate all these books. Study the tower. Living alone. Forever alone. Diary. Wait, why am I not looking at the diary? History of Grands. The ground seal. Why are we not looking at any of this? Sacred war. So in other words, you know, Runefaust. Mountains. Yes, mountains exist. Villages. Yes, villages are also things. Oh, that's a nice little detail. When he actually runs out of um, inventory space, he actually passes it immediately to somebody else. I like that. 
That is really, that is a nice little addition to the UI elements. That is so cool. Anything in here? A deep and dirty well. Alrighty then. Who are they? Well, fuck. Golem soldiers. Greetings, Grand Seal scum. Why did you kill so howl? How could you be so mean? The mean? Um. Answer me. Oh, we must defeat them so we can learn the truth. Capture them alive. Well, he has a portrait, so clearly he must be important. So, Chester Cheeto. So, what do you got? You're level four? Okay, that's pretty cool. He is a mage, and he's gonna be awesome! So, I'm actually defeating people this time. That's pretty sweet. Gollum. Wasn't that the name of a place in Shining Force 1? Maybe. Maybe I'm thinking of something in Bringing Dine. I don't know, man. Counterattack this biatch! Oh, I did, like, no damage at all to these guys. Alright. That's a good sign. Fucking bats! <sighs> Fuck your bats. So, pass me a 15 minutes ago. Her, I'm not saying this game is too easy, but I don't have, like, anybody here. Yeah, just pass me can just shut the fuck up. Straight F. Just straight up. No questions asked. Just no silence, child. You know not of what you speak. Alrighty, so. We gonna set you on fire. We gonna set you on fire! Thank you. Yeah, that's fine. Attack, attack Sarah. Son of a bitch! She's asleep! Why, why would I, why would I say that? Why would I invite that? Oh, you're sleeping. Thank you. Please don't let me get my ass kicked on, like, the third mission. On the third actual mission. Please don't kill him. You'd think that would wake him up! But, you know... What do I know? I'm just a functioning person with thoughts and feelings. So let's kill the weapon. No, the soldier. Whatever. I can't read. Hey! I'm also getting mad gold from these people. I think I can kill it. If you miss, I swear to God. Okay, thank God. So I wonder, did they nerf the whole bats being complete and utter bastards sort of deal? Because if that's the case, I'm totally okay with that. Because seriously, fuck bats from Shining Force 1, man. They're on like cliff racer level of just absurdity. Sarah is sleeping. Maybe one of you can wake them up by chance. Wake up, fuckers! Wake up! Wake the F up for Favor and thank you. Alright, we're just gonna actually- can I attack the other one? I can. I'm gonna attack the archer because that's hilarious. Ah, uh huh. Alright. Yeah, soldiers and archers, they uh... They uh, they hit real hard. They hit hard. You know, yeah. Man, what about the oozes? Thank you for waking up, assholes. Damn, for realsies. I, I kind of don't want to do this, because that means he's going to be directly in the line of fire, but, you know. War never changes, and I really need these guys to die quickly. Okay, Jaha. Be a meat shield for the mage, please. Damn, Jaha. Way to go, my friend. Now let's continue our poking fight. I poke you, and then you poke me. Haha. Uh -huh. I wonder if the damage is actually relative depending upon um, how far away they are. Like if he's directly next to him and does more damage sort of deal, it makes me wonder. Oh, whoa, 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 it makes me wonder. Oh, don't shoot the, don't shoot the mage. Dick. 
But all things so, we're making pretty good time, even though, you know, freaking Bowie was asleep in the entire damn time. He got bitten by a bat and was just like, I'm out, peace. Guy's not doing nothing. Okay. Fair point, I suppose. Now, do I have to kill everything or do I just have to go to town, I wonder? Alright, please be the tank, I know you are. Okay. Could be worse. Just a Cheeto. You need a little bit of uh, TLC here, my friend. These guys do not play. They're actual soldiers. Real adults with real armor, and they will murder the shit out of all of us because we're like 10. You know, once Bowie's armed, he's actually pretty damn okay. Not 100% certain how I feel about this, but you know what? I, you know, I can live with it, to be sure. Ha ha ha. Oh yeah, baby, Blaze 2, bitches! Woo! -hoo! Don't leave the priests behind. They're going to keep you alive. Oh yeah, that bat's pissed. Come here, bat. Let's start some. Start some shit, fool. Actually, no, I'm not gonna. Even, I'm not even gonna mess with you because you're not worth my time. I can kill you melee style. Right now, I, I rely upon Kazen to uh, get some extra damage on those heavily physically armored folks. Again, I stress: do not leave your your priest behind. That's going to end poorly for all parties involved. Specifically mine. Of course he's asleep. Sorry, I forgot to speak there for a second. Uh, I'm not really sure why. It was more to the fact that I just... Had just a genuine seething hatred for bats. Archers, don't kill him, don't kill him. Ho oh, ho, you are the luckiest motherfucker alive. But you're asleep, so, you know, fuck everything. Do you have a heal level two? No, you do not. All right, I guess I'm gonna heal Bowie because, you know, he's here. Gives me basically free experience. What level is she anyway? Ah, oh, fucking everything! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Be this damn it poop. He was my low level. No, fuck that. You're going right up in his grill, and you're gonna stab him in the face with a sword because that's how you roll. Damn it! You're a ten-year-old who murders things. Just that, that that's your life. Get over it. And Sarah, I want you to get the killing blow on one of them because I'm already in my head starting to like mentally ship. And that sounds like the biggest fuck of bullshit ever. Mentally ship like, no, Jaha, you must die. I shouldn't have killed the huge bat, I think. I maybe should have killed the archer instead. But she's getting the killing blow because I said so, damn it. Please do three damage. Damn it. Well, that's fine, you can shoot Chester. He's he's a nice pink cushion. He doesn't mind. Stay. Stay. Really? Two and one! Really? Motherfucker, are you serious? Okay, so, let's finish what we started. Murder him. Thank you. 49 experience, thank you. Please and thank you. What the hell is this? The battle strategy was wonderful, I praise you. The fuck? But I can't let you escape. What? 
That lad is the leader. Take him! What? Don't worry, he has only fainted. Take them to Gollum. What? Impossible! Gallon grants you our allies! But it's true. I'm a scholar. I'm here because I tried to stop him. I'm a leader of the Gollum army. I disagreed with the war and now I'm here. What did your kingdom do to Gollum? What is the reason for this war? What about Sir Howell? He was killed by Gollum. What did Gollum want? What is Ground Seal? Ground Seal. Do you know what Ground Seal is? We just fucking asked what it is, so obviously not! What is Ground Seal? Please, tell me. I heard King Gollum say those words. I just know that something is being concealed. What the hell is going on? Yawn. Adorable. Bowie, you finally woke up. We're talking about Ground Seal. Please, join in. So yeah, we're definitely going to join in next time. Same bad time, same bad channel. Uh, if you enjoyed what you saw, feel free to leave a like. If you want to see more, feel free to subscribe. If you want to send hate mail, hey, man, groovy, go for it. And I will see you guys next time. Peace out.